way. I, I actually compare it more so to Mag's farm. Is the slaughter getting more than the axe? And I would say absolutely. Uh oh, they're going for Milan here. They were waiting for Mag to rotate in, but they didn't even need him. They could have made that go from the start. And without vision there on the side, Milan can't see the rotation in from Sayoma's Skywrath Mage. So he will have to hand things over and be the real first blood of the game. The trade-off here is if they feel threatened by this early Morphling movement, let's say like you have a level 7 Slardar, level 5 Morphling, and plus 1 going on the AM, can you survive that gank? Nice snipe from Iceberg, but look who snipes him right back. Gogi crosses paths with Iceberg, who happened to take down the Elements Courier. And Gogi has to play this very safe under tower, but Slardar has made his way back, and it uh, looks like they're going the other way. Yes. They got the adaptive, they got the combo. Is it, it enough time? Kill. Yes, it is. That's a level 3 adaptive now. And that is plenty of time for him to just bottom. sprint his way into action while bottom lane. We have Swift Ending caught now between two. Beautiful setup by Mag right there. Gets the call while Iceberg gets out the front. But look who's here now. LeBron shows up, gets off that first stun. Battle Hunger and right clicks, though, will put Swift Ending down. And we have an even game already, 2-2. Two to two. Yep, trying to go for the ET there by FNG. Doty Doze get, baits them into an aggressive position and without any mana. And with the body blocks, they're able to bring that Luna down, which is a big kill. Again, we're going to see up top, nice little combo here. Will be a lot of damage potentially, but they unfortunately don't get the crush in time, and now it might be a turn the other way. It looks like it. Mag gets the, oh man, even an arrow on top of it. No chance for you, Mitch. Off with his head. And Mag will be able to put him out. Suddenly five heroes up on the top lane. They're wow. going to, should be able to follow this up with a tier one tower kill is, is the ideal, because you rotate this in the heroes, you want more than just a Sardar, but at the very least, they, they help the AM out. He is going to be going a couple of bops in. What kind of build is this? No bash, no no RNG, not looking for the luck, just looking Ow. to get arrowed oh, under tower. What a hitbox on that arrow. It looked like it was going to sail just under him. He moves oh. back in. He should have just gone for the right clicks there. but No bash, there's down. no chance. Yeah. He turns his like 25% to a 0% chance when he doesn't skill that up. It's, uh, it's a little sad, but yeah. obviously there's a lot of value. Well, back and below by the bottom rune. Breakout here for Gogi. There is a disruption save from Milan. Things get a bit awkward. Oh! Epic to go for the DMP, he's not gonna be. He makes it out. He makes it out and back to the fountain. He's gonna be good, but is Sayoma gonna be as lucky? Oh no, he's not. He gets crushed and slashed down. The chicken man will fall. And now Elements will be able to segue into this tier one mid lane and get the ending. He's gone. LeBron steps in as the bodyguard. And look at that. He replicates the axe now. Oh. And oh that replicate. LeBron could block him right there. Yeah, block him in between the two. Oh, he's it's not going to be blocked dead. in. So it doesn't matter anyways. Yeah, it's <laughs> LeBron's, I think his first kill of the game. You don't see those very often on his mid. So. Oh, and still Sayoma, who is trying to run in there possibly to plant down some intel. Crosses pass with Jug, jumping from Mag. Could help, and they get the turnaround play. Nice shot from Vega. Sayoma baiting in the Jug into an awkward position, and now it could be Mitch the next take down here. Silence, concussive shot. A jump in, duck. Wonderful alley-oop play there from Mag. Secures him the double. And Vega will take the initiative now. A 6-4 to four advantage. Arrow! Oh my god, that was a little too close for comfort there. They feel like they need to kind of get something done. They smoke, they head up back in the mid lane. They're looking to go for Iceberg here. And uh, with a leap away and a TP, it's not going to be good enough. Omni Slash will be there by Gogi just to ensure it. And they will claim the life of the secondary core of Vega. Have enough strength, I would hope, by that point. I mean, it's 1,800 now, for God's sakes. That you should be able to survive decently, plus waveform. So if you need to jump in, get the... You can get, a, you know, the adapt strike off before even a Manta if you're fast enough. But bottom lane, speaking of fast... Elements looking to go for both. Vega still trying to just slowly get an answer. There's going to be a nice uh, stomp. They woke up! In. Storm Skull, but yeah, with the wake up, not going to matter. Uh, so that's going to be a Rax taken by Elements here. Oh, man! FNG just gets shredded apart through the blender of this Luna. A free forgiving kill. Elements. You said you're up against two carries that scale pretty well. Have good Oh, Iceberg fires. casually walking in from behind. They you got know, the Moonlight Shadow tries to leap away. Oh no, Iceberg. Not the place you want to be. Maybe wasn't suspecting so many from Elements to be up here, but they're here. And nearly the, one of the lower seeded teams are coming back from it. And... It's on Vega to try to oh, upset them. Oh, Mag and company walk in. This was on the back of a smoke, and Max walks right into trouble. He's going to be taking out the axe. Gone. 40 seconds. Does have buyback, but that was not the approach Vega were hoping for. In him is Iceberg here, but elements are already getting surrounded. him. There's the jump. It's from Mitch. A long journey as we follow them all the way up here, and look what it leads to. A promising takedown. Mitch could lose his own life. No, they got the disruption waiting for him, and they're looking to jump to the back line to go for Iceberg. Purge will catch him. 
Gogi thinks about walking in, but they got basics to get back to as a tier two will be taken down. That's the last outer tower of the last lane with the last set of racks in what could be the last game of the series, Blaze. Last! Jump in, comes out, insta-kill on FNG. No Elder Titan for this defense, it looks like. Out for nearly 40 seconds of this game. Vega, as they smoke up and look for a hold. I, Elman should know, they were in this position in the last game. Mag jumps in, they get that insta-kill on the Gogi. That's a good start for Vega. Eclipse is going to be pop, but not very effective under the Moonlight Shadow and with the split coming out. It looks like FN is going to be caught. Disruption and Adaptive Strike. They locked him down. Look at the AM Illusions oh. do all the work necessary. That is not good. They will lose FN. LeBron is going to be on the fight back, but he is a big tanky support. Mitch jumps in from behind, gets the crush, but then quickly gets stomped down from FNG. Iceberg on the way out. LeBron still chasing for him. Will not be able to make catch. Mag and FNG looking to close out onto Mitch here now. LeBron's there to help, though, and should be able to, to stun and lock them down. Mitch is still hanging, man. They'll get the jump on Mag. They'll finish him off. FNG's got to get away. Uh-oh, FNG. He tries oh, to go valiantly. Bash, bash. Since this is uh, Shadow, Shadow of his former self, as he has just fragmented into... Oh! oh. Man, FNG, it has not been an easy game. It has not been an easy series for him. 0-3 on the Elder Titan gets crushed right there as he tries to get the stomp off. Iceberg has to dish out the Star Storm to try to slow the flow here. This is the... Last racks before Megas are out, and Shadow Demon Gaming is happening right before him now. Vega need to do something here. They're looking to reach, they're looking to dive. Mag is just committing on in, trying to get a hold of anyone from Elements here. He gets blasted apart, and now it's going to be a fan. I don't know if he mantles himself to the high ground, but he's stuck up there for now. We'll be able to blink down. Gogi eats a bit of damage burst from the Skywrath Mage. Now Sky blasted in the face with the adaptive strike. He is gone for good. And that last Rax is going to be. Brought down to its very foundation. Only tier fours and an ancient stand. Mega creeps are out. Elements, Dota. We have not seen a lot of them in the heavy spotlight, but this could be their season. A good start for them already with an upset on Vega. Absolutely insane. I mean, you look at guys like Mitch and Milan. They played together for over three years now and have had pretty marginal success throughout this time. Like, my insanity was probably their high point, and that nobody really remembers that team to a great extent, so... At uh, point, okay, FN's, FN is FN, as we all know who FN is, and FN is done with this game, so he's gone, Blaze. And this game's over. Yeah, it's just a, a function of the 2-0, man. It's, uh, <laughs> it's tough to, to be a, a Vegas Squadron.